Right, morning all. Oh, right. It's four past ten. Uh, Tuesday, June the seventh. Um, twenty twenty two. Right, I'm at home lane today. I had to come out. I was planning to come out, but not this early. But I had to come out early because the fucking neighbours were making a hell of a noise upstairs again. Unbelievable. Waking up very early. I'm at 7.30, 8 o'clock. I don't normally go up till about 10. But the noise, I was making so much noise, I couldn't bear it. So I just got my backpack and decided to come out earlier. Thing is, meaning going home a little bit earlier, which I don't really want to be doing. Um, well, I had a choice to come over here or um, Barney Hills or uh, doing a cemetery, but I wanted to come here today, so let's get the camera set around. Listen, can't do nothing. That's eerie. That's eerie guys when you can't do nothing. Can't do no birds, nothing. Is there any spirits around here? Whoa. Suddenly got really cold here. My name's Steve, I'm here to do a little bit of a research, see if there's any spirits around this particular area. I'm not here to cause you any problems. I can't harm you. But if you'd like to come forward and communicate, I'll be very grateful. In my hand I've got a EM, it's like an EMF meter, picks up electromagnetic energies which you are able to give off so if you can come forward and say hello I'll be very grateful camera turning on memory contains no images don't tell me I didn't well, there's a card in there right. so I've been here a few times in the past um, so I like taking photos of like the pathways which are kind of like not being used that much because you don't know what might be lurking inside them so yeah if there's any spirits amongst or near me or in this area I can come forward and touch this device it won't harm you just lets me know that you're around now I can hear birds See, near the uh, tram stop, it was so quiet you couldn't hear nothing. And that's a little bit eerie. You know, it's like when you watch these documentaries when people go into the woodlands and you hear all birds and suddenly it just goes dead quiet. That's a really creepy thing is I've got so many like hills and things to go up and down. My knees are already playing up. I'm coming up here another time one day, bring my milk detector. Is there any spirits amongst me? So come forward and say hello. Just don't harm me. I'm going to go over that way. I'll probably end up getting lost because I don't know how big this would have missed the bill, I'm sure. Has there been any deaths here? Any murders? Suicides? So, can you come forward and tell me the reason how you died or why you died? Yeah, there's so many pathways that you could do. So much. The thing is, like, you know, all these kind of like um, routes. Be very difficult to do some remote detecting now. Is this place even haunted? Does it have any spirits? Whether it be human spirits, elemental spirits? Elemental being spirits on the earth, from the trees from the plants
any elves, pixies, gremlins, goblins. <laughs> Just think you see like a little pixie or a little elf suddenly walking along the pathway. That'd be crazy. Um, go this way. Oh, I'm not here to harm anyone. I can't harm you anyway. There is somewhere, like a lookout point. But I don't know where exactly it is. Isn't there no spirits around here who want to come solo? Sure, there's got to be someone. Well, there's someone sitting out there then. Oh, look at that. Like a parakeet. Is there any strange creatures that dwell in this woodlands? Oh, okay, on this way. I will need to go for peace soon. So these little piles would be ideal to do some milk detecting on. I didn't bring my milk detector out today. I will bring it sometime. Hopefully I won't get caught or moaned at by the public. Right, there's uh, someone over there that's just put the cake a little away from it. Fueling point. I don't know where the fueling point is. Unless it's over here. No, there is a few points somewhere. Might be down there. No cycling. <laughs> Why can't you cycle on you? Can't stand in the woods. Let's just turn the camera off a minute. I don't know where the hell I am. That's the cafe restaurant, which I've never been to before. Might be down here. Let's just take a walk down here anyway. I don't know how long I'm going to be here today guys, but uh, you know, at least an hour or so. I might make tracks home, or well, not home, but tracks to another location. What's that to say? It's 
Green Park, two and a half miles, Petswood, eight and a quarter miles, Erith, 21 miles. You know, I'm going to walk 21 miles to Erith, Solston Woods, Hamsey Green, and Kingston Bridge. Hmm. Oh, there's the fueling point down there. I'm just about to see it. <sighs> Morning. Morning. Nice day. Yeah. It's gonna rain later though. Yeah. <laughs> only yeah, only fun showers. Fun. It's supposed to have like yeah. we're supposed to have thunder showers over the weekend, but we never got them. No, Weather think. never knows what she's gonna do, does it? It's just Light showers though. Eh? Light showers apparently. That's why I'm at early. <laughs> Don't get caught out in the pouring rain. <laughs> Have a good one. Andrew, enjoy yourself. Yeah, the viewing points over here you can actually see part of London from here. Well, I have been to the viewing point but I never came this way. I kind of like came through the trees because I got lost. <laughs> I thought, shit, well, if I go, last time I came here, you know, I did get lost. And I know I came from that direction, so I just went back that direction and I was able to find my way back to the tube, uh, tram stop, luckily. Nice flowers over there. Might get the ghost box out in a minute. See if we get anything. I'll take some photos over here anyway. Might go down, see what's down here, and then come back up this way later. But we will do ghost box. See what I mean? You can see very nice view. Part of London over there, I think. Is there any spirit people here? Can you come forward and let yourself be known? Use this device. So, EMF meter picks up your energy. Yeah, we'll take a little walk down there. It's a bit steep. Uh, quite a few though, innit? I know this camera's got anti shake on, but I don't know if it's on or off. And I can't be bothered to go through all the settings. Uh, menu. It's not even letting me go on the menu. Is there any spirits here? Any ghost entities? Can you come forward and say hello? Yeah, my camera's not working somewhere properly. Should have brought me other one out. Hmm. 
That's not working at all. Shake on this one. Car options. Auto focus. Motion detector. Oh no. Well, we don't seem to get nothing on the K2 meter. I forgot to bring the DC box because I was so fucking stressed out with the noise I was making upstairs. Because my neighbours never know when to shut the fuck up, when to stop making the noise. but I won't be using it today. Let's just do a quick EVP. So we get nothing on the EVP. If it works, I'll just not charge it up. Yeah, hello, is there any spirits around here today? My name's Steve, I'm not here to cause you any harm, disturb you, but if anyone's here, we should come forward and say your name. Can you come forward and say your name now, please? Has there been any deaths on this common? Where there have been accidental, suicide, murders? So what kind of death? Why are you still on the common? Do you like it here? Well, woodland actually. Do you like it here? Are you happy here? Is this your home? Did you um, work here?
Do you think this place is a nice place to be? Do you have anything you wish to say? If so, can you say it? And may uh, it be recorded on here, although I can't hear your voice. If you say something, I can play this back later and listen to it to see if I've got any responses. Okay, thank you very much. Turn that off. Start another walk. Actually, let's do a quick ghost box. Hello. Is there any spirits, man? If there's any spirits here, can you come through and talk to me through the frequencies, the radio frequencies, and the white noise? If anyone's here, can you tell me your name? Is this woodland haunted? Do you have any kind of activity here? Has anyone died here? If you died here, how did you die? What was the cause of your death? Can you tell me what your name is? You like being here. Did anyone work here? Your grandfather? What did he do? What work did he do here? How many spirits reside here, if any? Give me a number. Okay, if you communicate with me through the way, Joe, thank you very much. God bless. Alright. I'm going to put some of this stuff away. I need to go. I'm not for a little place. I can go to the loo. No, not that one. This bag keeps opening. I need to get another backpack actually. Keep the camera out. Yeah, I need to find a little enclosure somewhere so I can go to the loo. So these bits are like, you know, so steep. Problem is when you're coming back up, plays on the knee. I suppose I could go to, but it's too fucking far to walk. I'm pretty sure no one goes past there. So 
Honestly, this is so steep, this hill. I don't know how they've got footsteps here, a little pathway kind of thing, but when you're coming back up, it's the problem. If this was raining and it was all wet, look, you'd be sliding down here. I don't know why they didn't make more down this part. So I've got to try and find something before I go to the blue. Well, I'm going to turn the camera off a little while, guys, and I'll get back to you in a little bit. Right. Done what I need to do. Get my camera out. Can hear someone over there actually. Got to always keep making sure I've got my keys, my wallet, and my phone. And my camera and that. God, that's fucking hot. I had a torch turned on in my pocket and I didn't realise it's burning hot. My spirits amongst me. Please come forward and say hello. I'm not here to cause you harm, because I can't harm a spirit. You can harm me, but I request you don't harm me. I mean peace, friendship, compassion, love. Just want to know this, if this woodland's got any spirits inside of it. Now if you can't afford and touch this black meter, it'll light up different colours and let, let me know that you're here. Is there anyone here? You know, I don't know where the hell I am to be honest with you guys. I'm completely lost now. Might have to go back the way I came in there. Look at that. I can't walk up that, that slide. That slope. But that is the way I need to go. Is there any weird creatures here? Like Sasquatches, Bigfoot. Any dwarves? I think I know why I am actually. Is that, oh shit. If that's the tree, which I think it might be, well, I cut some uh, fat wood off once before, then I know where I am. Did someone try hanging himself here? There's a rope there. Yeah, I think I know where I am. I don't have to go all the way back around. All I've got to do is walk up that fucking like this slope then walk further on and I'll be heading back towards the uh, tram stop I might go back to um, Croydon and jump on another tr tram depending on what the time is 11 o'clock so I could go to uh, Beckenham Cemetery I think it's called and that's like another oh, from here tram stop to here er, to the Croydon's like that 10 minute and then from Croydon to the cemetery is uh, I think about another 15 minutes but it is meant to be raining later on today I don't want to be out in the rain. Those wild 
mushroom things. Yeah, I know where I am now. I think I've got to walk up this bloody slant because I did cut some fat wood off here before when I was looking for fat wood I have my little uh, handsaw with me yeah this is going to be a pain to get up it's already up in my knee I'll cut a little bit along here I might even walk down to the other woodlands but it's a bit of a walk though it was about a 15 minute walk I wish I caught something on camera like an apparition or something, that'd be cool then I can turn around and say, hey Cone Lane Woods is haunted yeah, I've got to go over that way to uh, get to the tube I could say tube, tram station tram stop I need to find a bench though I'm knackered already so I'm be sitting on the ground because it's wet for one and two it's going to be a problem getting back up on my feet <sighs> Jesus wish I was a lot more better a lot more healthier So I know I've got to go that direction but I don't know how far I've got to walk down this way to get to that direction to the tram stop and I've got to walk down and then back up look how deep it is freaking deep just wish I had more benches here I think there's one back there. I ain't gonna back up it on myself. <sighs> it's not so bad going down a little slight slant hill. So you've got to walk up. It's tiring. Let me just check that the camera camera's recording yep pull the camera back up a bit So I noticed that this tree was down I could have uh, cut some fat wood off there last time but I haven't been up here a while so it could be a fresh fall I'm going to sit down for 5 minutes or a couple of minutes at least get my breath back so I've been sponsoring the guy um, who does bushcraft and, 
and he said he was going to make that one, but he never did. I sent him like a, a gift package as well, which cost me about 20 quid. He swore that he was going to get me fat wood, but he never did. So I sent him a £20 gift thing, and then it cost me like extra amount on postage. So I think it came to about 30 quid in total. Plus I've got him on Patreon. And I can't find the bloody account where I had him on Patreon. So otherwise I'll stop the Patreon. Alright, I won't do another ghost box here because I don't think we're getting much anyway. And there are people walking around now. Look how deep that is here. That's quite deep. I don't think many people go down that side. It's more this main path. But I've got to go over that way to get to the fucking tram stop. You know, I might go to uh, Beckenham Cemetery. So I haven't been there for a bloody long time. I think the last time I went there was with Evan, my nephew. And I think that was about 2014, I think. 2015. So I would like to go there. Just got to find a bloody clear section. I can get down there and walk back up again. So I've not really got anything on, well I didn't get nothing on the K2 meter. Um, don't know if we've got anything on camera. I don't know where I am now. <laughs> I think I'm lost here now. I think we walk that way. That should take us near to the tram. The bird aviaries, little bird boxes up there. Well, quite a few actually. There's there. Some there. Some there. Camera don't want to work. That one again. Kicking it bluey. And it's right, it's not on. Let's go this way. I can hear the traffic, so it can't be far from the tram stop now. Now I can hear the traffic there. I think we go straight over that way. That might be where the tram stop is. Yeah, I think it is actually. Yeah. So we'll have to cross over, get the tram, and I think we might nip up to uh, 
a cemetery and do like a little cemetery uh, video so I do want to do some more cemetery stuff mm -hmm. I'm going to take the piss or shit or something. Oh, I just missed the tram. I don't think I'm going to get it. Right, so I just come out of the cemetery just here, and beside there's like a, a footpath going into some woodlands. So I thought I'd come in here, see what's in here. Might do a ghost box and EVP session. Oh, look at fish. Big fish there, dead. That's two things I've seen dead today. Fox. I just saw that fox. It's got two babies with it. Right, K2 meter one. More photos I'm going to take. I just want to see where this goes actually. If anywhere. Anywhere interesting. I doubt I'll be using the ghost box or EVP recorder. Just want to come in here and see where it goes. More kind of like overgrown than anything. Don't know what that is over there sticking out. I could have walked down the pathway that way, see where that went. What I'm going to do is walk up and round that area, see where that goes, and I'm going to start walking back and then start heading home I do have a, a new EMF meter coming but I don't know if it's going to turn up today or tomorrow I ordered it last bloody week and the tracking number ain't working I don't think I'm not going to cut across it's probably too hilly and bumpy and my knees already hurting some woman just sat to us right across the arse over there. Now we walk up here to see what turns out up here. See if I'm getting to any woodlands or something. Oh, I ain't the husband and wife, it's two girls. <laughs> Is there anyone around? I think the battery's running low again. No, I didn't get no hits on the K2 meter in that cemetery. Which was a bit of a shame. But you know, might have caught something on camera, video, audio. I might call an apparition on camera camera I might call it something on video camera, I don't know You know the video cameras do more stuff than what you can actually see Could do it on a loop Let's go in here, 
see where this goes. Turn the code two metre off so I ain't getting nothing on it. Can't turn the camera off, guys. Yeah. Right, so I've come to like a little crossroads here. Um, still goes full way back there, I think. Um, I'll, I'll have another couple of minutes walk up this way, see where it goes, but then I'm going to start heading back. I've been out a good three hours, maybe more than that, actually. I think it's about 12.40, 12.56, so I've been out, and it's starting to rain a little bit of swell. I don't think the camera's getting all wet. I don't want to end up getting wet either. <laughs> oh, another little crossroads as well. By the looks of things. I might have to take shelter under some trees if it starts pissing down the rain, which I'm hoping it ain't going to do. So the British weather said it's going to rain all through this week then suddenly it changed its mind and yeah, another crossroads I'm actually holding the camera now so it's not on my head I'm just holding it because it does start raining quite heavily I don't know what that is, it's got a great big wire fence all around it. A real big fence. Yeah, it kind of continues further that way. I don't know if it go where it goes this way. But I ain't going to go any further. Might try coming down here again next time I'm down near the cemetery. I'm going to head start heading back to the tram station. And, uh, well, not station, tram stop. Now I'll put the camera back on the edge. So I'm just do a little bit of video in all the way back. Probably going to take me about 10 minutes to get back. Um, I've done what I needed to do. <laughs> I did just have a drink of water, but I'm already thirsty again, would you believe? Wouldn't like to come over here and milk detector because it's just too stony, too much brick. But there's other coins, you know, probably in the ground, but I wouldn't be able to dig it. Just too much stoned rocks and bricks. Well, we got a milk detecting the big black over at what's my uh, what place I went this morning. It'll be over at um, Comb Lane, the woods over there. Could go that way and round, but I ain't going to. 
I'm just keeping this light overgrown because it's raining and this will keep me sheltered from the rain a little bit. Camera might get hit on the old uh, branches time to time, maybe, but I don't know. I can't help that. So what I'm going to do with this part of the videos, I'm going to put on to the first video, the current rain uh, woodlands. So I'll uh, put that to, I'll do the comb lane video and then I might either join it to comb lane or I might put this as a separate one and name this like Woodlands Beside Cemetery. Oh, thank you, right? Hello, any spirits around? Any spirit people want to come forward and say hello? Is anyone following me from the cemetery? You ain't supposed to. I don't know any negative entities following me home. No demonic ones, no evil ones, no shadow creatures, shadow men. You ought to go back from where you came from. So no following me home please. I'm going to do the Lord's Prayer again before I leave and I'll get to the tram stop. Actually I might do it now. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thou kingdom come, thy shall be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And because of our trespasses, we forgive those who trespass against us. Deliver us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. It's a bit dark and spooky down here, it's a bit The only spirits, negative ones that follow me, has to go back. I demand and command you to go back from where you came from. You're not going to come home and cause me problems. Got enough problems with the neighbours upstairs. Unless you got them fuck with him, I don't give a shit then. Do any spirits want to say hello before I turn this off? Say hello. Hello, who said hello? Can you tell me any spirit names? Where am I? Can you tell me what woods I'm at? I don't know what woodlands I might, so can you tell me the woodland name? If it's got a name? So if you communicate with me for the ghost box, I appreciate it. Thank you, God bless. Turn that off now. I'm hoping I've still got everything with me. on the mobile with the camera oh my bloody knees are killing me man actually I'm going to put my stuff in my bag well, I think I'll probably call this video quits now guys so again if you like the video want to show it out please do so Hit the notification bell for more videos when I release them and I'll catch you later on on the next video when that will be probably in a few days time hopefully so yep thanks for tuning in thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one just quickly put these back right yeah, don't forget, thumbs up, if you like the video, share, like, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications for the next video, and I'll catch you later. Bye for now, this is Steve, signing off.